the Yorkshire T condition stakes is next and this is a 0 to 65 handicap and it's over a mile and a half it's a pretty big looking field as well and the top one is Hollywood rolling for Derek Hinton Northern K for Obi Wan, Hither Green for Stu Gray, Girl V for Doug Warren, Texan Cowboy, Graham Clutterbuck, Unex Much, Jim Follis, Mockaliff Seaview for Doug Warren, Exotic Dancer of Artillery, and we've also got the Chingford Scouser, Red Dickens for Dan Hughes, Dan Dare's Girl, Darren Howes, Brock Lesnar, Stu Gray, Street Dancer Alex Cherry, Sea Sunlight, Dan Hughes, Semolina and Scintillate for Kevin Meenahan, Geronimo Misses for Darren Howes, and Belgian New Year for Alex Cherry. That's the full list then. They're all in, and away they go. A little bit slow to go with the Alex Cherry and Doug Warren pair, but over on the inside, the Chingford Scouser is the first one to show with Sea Sunlight. And that was outside, Chingford Scouser pulling for its head a bit willful, and then Sea Sunlight and Hollywood Roaring after that, then Northern Cave and Brock Lesnar, Mockliff, Seaview is after that one, looking towards the back of the field, Girl V is just the back mark alongside Semolina. Kevin Mina hands with all scintillate is also close to the back, but Sea Sunlight has now gone on from Northern Cave in second. Then comes Mockaliff Seaview and Brock Lesnar. You next much is next, then Hollywood Roar and the Chingford Scouts has lost its place. Then also towards the back there is the grey exotic dancer, but it's Sea Sunlight who's about four lengths clear of Mockaliff Seaview in second. Then comes Northern Cave. On the inside, Brock Lesnar's got a good split. Then comes Dan Dare's girl. Street Dancer is getting closer. Also, Unix, much Hollywood Rollins got the rail. Chingford Scouser trying to run on again. Then comes Belgian New Year and Geronimo Mrs. Scintillate trying to make a forward move. Semolina and Texan Cowboy and out of the back, but it still sees sunlight in the lead as they come down towards the seven furlong mark. And Sea Sunlight leads by about four lengths to Northern Cave in second. Then Brock Lesnar is third. Then comes Girl V and Street Dancer. The Chingford Scouts is getting a little bit closer. And Mockaliff CV on the outside. The two Doug Warren horses are now making a forward move. But it's Sea Sunlight who's clearing the lead from Brock Lesnar in second. Then Mockaliff CV and Girl V. Then comes Dan Dare's Girl on the Chingford Scouts. Hollywood Rollins after that one. Then Northern Cave and Street Dancer. Exotic Dancers trying to get going. Scintillate and Semolina are also cutting through the pack quite nicely towards the back. Texan Cowboy and Red Dickens now share last place but Sea Sunlight is being pressed on his outside by Dan Dare's girl then Brock Lesnar and Mockaliff Seaview together Northern Cairns after that one then Semolina and Girl V Street Dancer is next then Hollywood Roaring Exotic Dancers making a forward move but it's Sea Sunlight who's still in the lead with three and a half to go Sea Sunlight in the lead from Dan Dare's girl in second Brock Lesnar and Mockaliff Seaview Exotic Dancer now making a forward move then comes um, Semolina's after that you next much Heather Green now trying to get into it the other grey but it's still Sea Sunlight who's going to try and make this a pillar to post win coming into the final two furlongs it's Sea Sunlight in the lead from Brock Lesnar an exotic dancer and Dan Dare's girl here comes Heather Green then Unix Much and Semolina and Mockliffe Seaview's after that one the complexion of the race changes the leader drops away they're coming down towards the final furlong and it's Brock Lesnar on the inside exotic dancer on the outside here comes Heather Green and Dan Dare's girl exotic dancer just poked their head in front it's exotic dancer racing into the final half furlong exotic dancer here comes Heather Green on the outside Brock Lesnar exotic dancer Heather Green exotic dancer just from Heather Green second Dan Dare's girl was good and Unix Next much from Brock Lesnar. See, Sunlight ended up last, would you believe, after leading virtually all the way. And it was Grays to the fore and commentators to the fore as well. As Exotic Dancer takes it, beating Hither Green. That's exciting race. And well strung out and see sunlight there it all the way right at the back so exotic dancer takes it then for marty lead hither green for stu gray was second dan dares girl for darren howells was third brock lesnar for stu gray was fourth and unix much for james follis was fifth